Crimson Tide, Florida's coastal crisis. Imagine pristine beaches now littered with dead fish. The air is thick with a foul stench. This is the reality for parts of Florida battling red tide. The Sunshine State is no stranger to this alarming phenomenon. Red tide, a harmful algal bloom, is a recurring threat to Florida's marine life, tourism, and overall well-being. Understanding this environmental crisis is crucial for protecting our coasts and communities. The time to act is now. Understanding the enemy, red tide, and harmful algal blooms. Red tide is caused by a microscopic marine alga called Carinia brevis. This tiny organism produces potent toxins that are harmful to marine animals and humans alike. These toxins can lead to massive fish kills, contaminate shellfish, and cause respiratory issues in humans. When conditions are right, such as warm water temperatures and abundant nutrients, these algae can multiply rapidly, creating what is known as a harmful algal bloom. These blooms discolor the water, often giving it a reddish-brown hue, hence the name red tide. Harmful algal blooms, including red tide, occur naturally in coastal waters worldwide. However, human activities such as pollution and industrial runoff can exacerbate their frequency and intensity. Nutrient pollution from agricultural runoff, sewage, and stormwater runoff can fuel these blooms, making them more severe. Climate change, with its rising sea temperatures and altered rainfall patterns, may also contribute to the problem, creating a more favorable environment for these harmful blooms to thrive. The state of emergency current impacts in affected areas. The current red tide outbreak is severely impacting various parts of Florida's Gulf Coast, causing widespread concern among residents and officials alike. Coastal communities are experiencing significant fish kills, respiratory irritation in humans, and a noticeable decline in tourism, which is a major source of income for many. The economic toll on businesses that rely on fishing and tourism is substantial, with many shops and fishing operations closing down due to the lack of visitors and the contaminated waters. Marine life is bearing the brunt of this ecological disaster, struggling to survive in increasingly toxic waters. Manatees, dolphins, sea turtles, and countless fish species are succumbing to the toxins produced by the red tide, leading to heartbreaking scenes on our shores. The sight of dead and dying marine animals washing ashore is a stark reminder of the devastating impact of red tide, affecting both the ecosystem and the local community. It's heartbreaking to see our beautiful beaches, once teeming with life and activity, now filled with distressed marine life and deserted by tourists. The community is really feeling the effects, from health issues caused by the toxins in the air to economic struggles due to the decline in tourism and fishing. We need more action to protect our environment and our livelihoods, including stronger regulations and more effective cleanup efforts to mitigate the impact of red tide. Fighting back, local responses and mitigation efforts. Local authorities and organizations are working tirelessly to mitigate the effects of red tide. They are coordinating efforts to ensure that the community is well prepared and informed. Cleanup efforts are underway to remove dead fish from beaches and waterways. These efforts are crucial in maintaining the health and safety of our coastal environments. Public health advisories are being issued to warn residents and visitors about the risks associated with red tide exposure. These warnings are essential to prevent health issues and ensure public safety. Research is ongoing to better understand red tide and develop effective mitigation strategies. Scientists are dedicated to finding long-term solutions to this persistent problem. 
scientists are exploring methods for controlling nutrient pollution and disrupting the growth of harmful algae blooms. Their work is vital in creating a sustainable future for our marine ecosystems. Public awareness campaigns are crucial for educating the public about red tide and encouraging responsible environmental practices. These initiatives help foster a community that is informed and proactive. We're committed to addressing this crisis head on. Our dedication is unwavering and we are determined to make a difference. Our teams are out there every day working on cleanup and providing critical information to the public. Their efforts are making a significant impact on the community. It's a community effort and we need everyone to be involved to make a real difference. Together, we can overcome the challenges posed by red tide and protect our beautiful coastal areas for future generations.